Hello, I'm Steve, this is Bit of Munch. And in this video, I've got a curry. Little, what's cooking? Chicken tikka masala, that's what's cooking. Well, it's already cooked. Now, I've already tried the Chinese chicken curry and chicken korma from this range. Uh, the Chinese chicken curry was really good, but tasted nothing like any chicken, a Chinese chicken curry I've ever had. And the chicken korma was similar. It was really good, but it was, didn't bear much resemblance to a chicken korma I'd had before. So, I'm not a big fan of chicken tikka masala, but I figured if this doesn't taste much like a chicken tikka masala, I'll probably like it. Anyway, this is 149 by the way, from Little. And here it is. And as you can see, I've done a few chips on the side. A few chips in the air fryer. Why not? Because chips always go well with a curry, don't they? Right, what does it say about this? What does it say about this? I don't know, what does it say about this? <clears throat> Cooked marinated chicken pieces in a creamy spiced tomato sauce with spiced basmati rice mix. Uh, how much chicken's in this? 15% chicken. Uh, I'm not going to read you everything. Nah. That's not my style. <laughs> right. Let's have a go. What should we do first? Let's have some rice. I added quite a lot of water to this, so hopefully it'll be all right. Lovely taste, but still a little dry. Hmm. Here's a question for you, right? You get microwave rice in a pouch on its own, and it's usually really good. But microwave rice in a ready meal like this quite often isn't that good. Ben's, which used to be Uncle Ben's, why don't you bring out a range of ready meals with your rice? Because your rice is really good. There's an idea for you. Hmm. The rice with the sauce, obviously, is much better. Let's try a bit of the sauce on its own. <laughs> um, hang on. Hang on. That's like eating a slightly spicy Heinz tomato soup. <laughs> that's what it reminds me of anyway. And that's not a bad thing, because I really like Heinz tomato soup. It's a classic, isn't it? It's really good, but yeah, this is similar to the others in the range. It doesn't really taste like what it's supposed to, but I like it. <laughs> Okay, let's dip a chip in the sauce. Got to be done. Then I'll try the chicken. Mmm. I've always been a fan of uh, chips in spicy Heinz tomato sauce. <laughs> to soup, rather. Right, I'll put it down for a minute so I can cut the chicken up. Three, four, five... You get six pieces of chicken of varying sizes. And there's a there's a piece of it. Looks alright. Let's see what it tastes like. Mmm. 
really nice chicken, really nice chicken. Okay, bit of everything all together, bit of rice, bit of chicken in the uh, spicy Heinz tomato soup. Mmm. Mm. It's not particularly, <coughs> excuse me, it's not particularly spicy. It's very tomatoey, very tomatoey. And it really is like a slightly spicy, you know, well, you know, I've already said it a few times, Heinz tomato soup, which isn't bad. I like it. I'd buy it again. Definitely. Let's just, uh, have one more bit with some rice and I'll go and sit down and eat the rest of this. So, little what's cooking, chicken tikka masala. I'll tell you what's cooking, Heinz tomato soup curry. And that's a good thing, in my opinion. A little bit of heat building there. The rice is a bit dry. Um, once you add it to the sauce, it's fine. It's really good chicken. I've said everything about the sauce. I'm not going to repeat it again. And everyone knows what chips taste like. I recommend it. There's another one from Lidl's What's Cooking range that I recommend. I've also done the, um, what did they call it? Sausage dinner from this range. And that was good as well. Right, thanks for watching. Let me know if you've tried this. I'm sure a lot of you have. And let me know your opinion. I mean, everyone tastes things differently, don't they? You might say, oh, Steve, tastes nothing like soup. What are you on about? <laughs> and I don't mind if you say things like that. It's fine. Everyone's opinion is different. Everyone tastes things different. Right, thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button. And I'll see you in the next video.